Hello there, fellow captains. This is Randy Mabob, and we're going to be playing some more Dreadnought. Now, I apologize that I haven't been putting up videos. Just some things got in the way, and I couldn't get around to it. But to make it up to you all, I present you the Monarch. Now, the Monarch, if you don't know, is the T5 Heavy Dreadnought. Uh, as of recording this, as far as I know, I am the first one in the game to get the Monarch, and I'm also um, the only one currently with the Monarch. Uh, that could change by the time this is uploaded, or, you know, within the next couple of days, but um, you get to see it here first. So, all of them come with a uh, special cosmetic for the T5s, and this one's in the theme of Tear, and it just looks gorgeous i'm gonna do a video that'll be more of a closer look to these but for now we're gonna show you some gameplay footage all right we're back so we're doing some onslaught at kappa base um, i'm rocking out the uh the monarch as you see um Main differences between the Jutland and the Monarch is Monarch comes with a base hit points of 90,000 and 125 energy pool. Uh, it's a little bit slower than the Jutland, and its primary weapons actually work. Uh, it's probably comparable to the pre-shipyard update Monarch's ballistic cannons, and it's just, it's good to have weapons that work again, because I can finally put flats or some other secondary on that I'll actually get a lot of use out of. Um, unfortunately, I don't have any T5 modules at all, so I'm just using my T4, so really, my main advantage, if you will, is I have 10,000 more hit points, and I can actually use primary weapons. Everything else is on par with, with the Jutland. So, I'm in a really bad situation. I, I was talking too much and I uh, didn't get out early enough this, yeah. I need to need to pay more attention, but I'm trying to talk to you and, and just share my joy of possessing the monarch. It's it's a great ship. Um, I'd like to hear y'all's opinions down below. Uh, what ships do y'all fly? Which ones do y'all uh, are y'all working for? Um, let me know down down in the comments below so we can uh, kind of kind of get an idea of what everybody's feeling. Oh, I, I did it and help him. Uh, oh, yeah, I'll shoot that. Yeah, yeah, saved your life. That's right. That's right. All right, let's let's uh, let's get into battle. I'm pretty sure y'all don't want to see me just floating here. Um, but pretty much, you know, just like with, with any any ship, regardless of tier, you, you play stupid, you're going to die stupid. Um, and I dance on that line of aggressive play and stupidity, and I quite often cross the line, as y'all probably seen, especially if you've played with me in matches, I I am very gung-ho, and it, it can lock. probably be very Fire frustrating to my team to. sometimes, but I don't like tucking behind a mountain and just sitting the there and poking above captain. it. If I want to do poke matches, I'll go play some Mech Warrior. Um, Come on, come on, yes. come on, come on. Yeah. Alright, let's let's go help out our, our friend. He needs some assistance. So we're warping in. Oh yeah, let's let's get some work done. Oh yeah. Oh yeah, you're next too. Um I, I don't seem to have a healer right now, so I'm not sure how this is gonna pan out. Let's actually let's get him with that too. Um, one of these guys are going to die before me, I hope. Or I'm going to look really stilly. Yes. Yes. All right, we got two of them. <laughs> that's, that's how I justify blowing up. Hey, that was a quick warp in. All right, um, where's the battle? So, I kind of wish they'd slightly tweak 
the base speed of both the Jutland and the Monarch because it makes it feel, if you want to get into competitive play, that you need to have warp jump or assault thrusters to get around. Or by the time you get into battle, the battle's already going to be over uh, because nobody waits for the Monarch. They're just, or, or the Jutland for that matter. They just zoom on ahead, leave their tank behind, and uh, so the only way you can actually keep up with the, the flow of the battle is to have, you know, have warp jump on there. Um, so I wish there'd be a little bit more leeway so that some of the other options in slot forward feel a little bit more uh, viable. You know, as much as I love having a big chunky wall of hit points or nigh invulnerability for like 10 seconds, um, it means nothing if you can't catch up with the enemies or your teammates, you know, <laughs> so, um, I guess we call them highly situational, but, you know, the warp jump always gets plenty of use. Oh, y'all could see that in... See my thought process. I was, I was thinking real hard about jumping on that artillery, but I, I thought against it because their entire team is there, and I'll probably die. Um, let's get them to just waste all their shit on me. I got a pocket healer right now. They're shooting at me. All is good in the world. Let's, uh, let's get target. Yeah. I'm trying to put some pressure on their healers, um, or we're not going to get anywhere. Um, what do y'all think? I think we should do something stupid. I think we should do something stupid. Let's do something stupid. We're going to die gloriously. Oh yeah. Oh, he'd be so dead if I could broadside him right now. Oh, come on. Is damaged, Captain. Oh. Shield activated. oh, come on, just die. I really don't want to waste my missiles. There we go. Okay, you you get it, missiles. Oh. So, how y'all doing? I you know, can't really see anything right now. I'm just firing in random direction, and I'm dead. See, I told you, die gloriously. Actually, that, that felt kind of shameful, you know. Just... It was like someone put a bag over my head and beat me down with some bats. So, oh, he's popping. Is he going to get out? Nope. <laughs> Alright, there's our healer. Sharing out the love. I'm going to press their healer some more. Oh, come on. We'll finish him. He's going to die. Oh, no. We got him running, though. That's all that matters. Just gotta keep up some pressure. Um, yeah, let's go. Let's let's mosey over there. I'm not gonna warp over there because it seems like in time I'm warping, uh, my healers lose track of me for a little bit, or I leave them and someone comes and starts crap with them. Uh, looks like they got a tractor beam going. Or is that a tractor beam pod? I think that's tractor beam pod. So, I'm going to show y'all the best maneuver ever. It's called the Mabob maneuver. And basically, you try to get yourself tractored, and you let them pull you to their deaths. At least, that's how it goes in my mind. Most of the time, it doesn't really go that way. But, when it works, it's phenomenal. So, for you... <laughs> Newer players out there, do yourself a favor and don't tractor beam monarchs. Save it for the smaller ships, because monarchs and jutlins, the closer they get to you, the more damage they're going to be doing, and they got a lot more hit points than you do. Unless you're a monarch, and then if you're. I'm not a big fan of tractor beams, but oh, here it comes! Oh, yeah. Come on. I will kill something in here. Why isn't he dying? Oh my god. Oh, dude. I, I apologize for the retaliator sounds. Oh my god. That. 
I, I've been hearing that for the last few hours. I, I heard it in my sleep the other night. But, alright, we got something done. Let's, uh... Uh, do I want to go over there? Let's poke at it some. I should probably deal with this guy. Let's say hello. Oh, them broadsides are nasty. Oh, man. Alright, what do we got? There's my healer. They got destroyer there. Plus another destroyer up there. And that healer, my healer's gone. So, okay. I'm not going to win this. Yeah, th this. Activating primary weapons, Captain. If I can get him to bugger off, maybe. No, he's he's standing his ground. I'm peacing out. Uh, yes. I'm bringing you friends. I'm bringing you friends. All right. Um. Yeah, I got like 25k hit points. I need to get out of here. Oh God. Not like this. Okay. This feels wrong, just hiding, cowering behind the mountain with my, my monarch. We'll, we'll let them know we're still around. That's right. Oh God. Is that someone warping on me? Who's warping what? Okay, it's friendly. <laughs> Sorry, it gets a little uh, little touch and go when you get kind of low. Which I don't know why I'm freaking out over thirty thousand hit points. Most tacticals run with that, but you know, I just don't feel that. Um. Full power to maneuvering thrusters. Man, I wish that regeneration would kick in already. That's the thing that annoys me about Onslaught is you got all the little fighters and the assault ships and they're constantly plinking you, which makes it really hard to go hide somewhere and recover. Alright. Oh. Come on, I want to steal it. I want to steal it. Let me has it. Oh, come on. Oh, yes. Neutralized. Yeah, that, that was all me, right? Y'all y'all saw that, right? Broadside black firing broadside. I, I'm, I'm a terrible person. All right, let's um. Uh, ooh. Well, I got a healer now, so it's uh, it's time to play. Oh, I'm, I'm just gonna go curb stomp this T2 right here. Is that the T2? That's T3. All right. Oh, he's gone. Let's finish him off. I really don't want to use missiles on you. Just, just die politely. Oh, yep, you're gone now. Ain't coming back from that. Okay. How are y'all doing over there? Oh, that. Artillery is just wrecking y'all's shit, isn't it? Yeah, he, he's harassing the, uh, the Koshi. I'm gonna just press that guy, and I'm gonna jump on this guy. If it even makes him not shoot for a couple volleys, that's all I ask. Alright, let's take care of you. Oh, come on. And he took a beating. Alright. Amplifying weapons, I. Am I close enough? Oh. System drained. <laughs> I'm, I'm getting tired of being scrambled. Understood. It's ridiculous. The enemy have warped yeah, you're, you're dying regardless now. Like, I'm not leaving until you're dead. System drained. Starting cooldown. Oh, man. Two plasmas, and he's still not dead. There we go. And he's still scrambled me again. This. Activating primary weapons, Captain. We've got a lock. I'm so tired of scrambles all weekend. All weekend it's just been scramble, this scramble, that scramble, this scramble, that. Um, oh man, that it, it just infuriates me. And I'm waiting to hear the sound of, you know, purge ram or blast ram firing up uh, right after I get per uh, 
you know, get scrambled. You know that sound. You know the sound. If you've ever been rammed, you know, like, even if it's your own teammate coming at you, you're, you're still, you know, you're, you're puckering up a little bit, getting ready to, you know, get your, uh, your hole busted in. Oh, man, <laughs> these scrambles. All right, well, we finish this guy off. Oh, come on. Oh, oh. Well, we won, but I didn't get the kill. Anyways, guys, thank you very much for watching. Um, don't forget to subscribe if you like it. Uh, until next time, stay classy.